So, some of you sharp-eyed viewers out there probably sensed that something was off with the scene with Clea Markey and Val Sarthi. This was done intentionally by the directors and cinematographer. In multi-million dollar TV shows, the framing of every shot can be discussed and planned months, if not years, ahead of time. There's an artistic concept when it comes to framing paintings, which later progress to photography and videography, called Rule of Thirds. It essentially breaks the screen into nine different areas. At the four points where the lines intersect on screen are the natural focal points for the viewer's eyes. The traditional rule of framing a person in an interview style shot usually involves placing the eye line of an individual on one of these thirds and having their face slightly turned towards the empty side of the screen where there's more space. Masters of cinema understand these rules, that's one of the first things they're taught, therefore they also understand exactly what happens when they break these rules. We as viewers might not understand the specifics of these cinematic rules, but we can sense that something is different and weird with the framing. And in this case, placing Clea and Vel on these focal points and then pointing them towards the side of the screen where there's no room at all is supposed to create a sense of anxiety and uncertainty in what lies in the future, which is fitting here because they're discussing the murder of Cassian Andor, which sits wrong with just about everyone, I think. 